My name is Rob Martinelli. I am the Senior Director of Customer Experience at Quest Diagnostics. So Quest Diagnostics is a company that provides testing and, and resulting services to help um, the, the broader uh, customer population with managing their health. The first um, opportunity when joining Quest was we were a, we're a very large organization and I think creating a very central view of what our customer journeys were like. That was key. Understanding kind of what all those journeys were and also targeting our larger segments of where we do business the most. A lot of the times you will have organizations that don't have that level of groundwork or baseline established. So when I walked into Quest, that was the first order of business for us is that we wanted to create that journey view, educate our stakeholders, also get, let our customers know that we have their best interest in mind and we are able to understand what they're looking for from a journey perspective. So to create that journey-centric view at Quest, we spent the time to pull many elements together. First, we had to engage and understand who were the main segments that we wanted to do, that we do business with, and then also bring in the element of VOC. So if you bring those three out, those two elements together with the data, now you have a really, really compelling case of how you have the journeys that really explain from where a customer starts and where they end and continue their, their work with Quest but then also have the data elements to help supplement and bring out where do we have to improve with pain points, things that our customers are telling us that they want to do business with us, but for some reason something is in their way. Forrester's role in that was very important from the standpoint that I had an external expert that could patch me into various resources. And the analyst was able to give me what were the main things that you should target as far as metrics and reporting, also elements related to governance structure. So who should be on this governance with you? Who should be there? Then also on the final piece on the journey side, what were the key elements you need from a look, feel, contents perspective? So Forrester being able to point to really good examples of that and also point us to even other resources as far as like, how do we establish these journeys or how do you establish a governance structure? How do you also get your metrics in place and what does that look like? How do you measure it? So very, very good to get that a good understanding and have Forrester there to shepherd me through kind of this reset, but also to position me for what I want to do next when it comes to customer experience and be able to set me up for success for this next phase of how we evolve it. Part of the big result for us at this early stage is that we now have a really good, really good presence within our company. First, on the side with, with its customer experience team, we now have a brand new structure. We are set up in the right way. Now we're, and we're embedded in those key projects. The second piece is that now we've got this new refreshed view of what customer metrics mean. So your typical NPS, CSAT, and custom reference score. That was very important because now we actually have built a customer centric dashboard. We're calling it our quarterly CX digest. And what it's doing is it's giving us the ability to showcase all the various CX metrics, how we're performing, making sure that we're targeting the right things. And this is on a regular basis. This is something that we're doing all the time. It's not the, the snapshot, it's not the journey, it's not the VOC. It literally is being collected and shared every single month and helping to drive action within um, within um, action within our company, but it's also helped rally like the leadership team, representing operations as well as marketing customer experience.